Okay, just a little bit on um, machining the exhaust seats. Here's the cutter here I use. It's got a pilot in it, which is the same size as the valve stem, which will fit down our valve guide. So that centralizes the actual tool. And if we look under the underside of this, is tungsten carbide tip. Just trying to pick up the angles for you. You'll see there's actually three angles on this valve tip, cutting tip. And that's how we end up with our three angles. And we'll get a fourth one in there a little bit later when we relieve the chambers. So when I do it, I'll slide that in there. What I also do too, I, I cut them down to a depth and it, what I do, I've made up a little, just a little slider that slides up and down and what, what I'm doing when I, after I cut the seat, I actually check from the bottom where the spring sits, you can see underneath here, to the top of the valve. Right. And get them level. and then that lines up perfectly flat that way you can adjust it so when I cut the seeds every single valve seat is exactly the same length from the spring seat to the top of the collet groove which is in your installed height which gives you when the valve is closed your spring pressure so what I'm getting at is when I cut the seeds I'm actually blueprinting them so every single valve spring has exactly the same pressure in pounds per square inch, exactly. So, what we'll do, start this up. And we'll actually start setting it up. Cutting the inner 70 degree angle at the moment. These inserts are very hard. Come up here and finish. Give it a blade, just watch your ears. Ears and eyes. That should do it. That should do it, I think. Just give it another play job. Here's an off. Right, so there it is there, all nice and finished. Yeah, so I'm just trying to get the right light, it's too shiny. But you get the general idea. And what we do is we get our exhaust valve, show them in the seat, get our little jiggy jig, and put it on the valve seat and throw that. Perfect. There you go. And that's how I blueprint my valve seats to get my spring pressure exact. Two to go and we're right.